Hey guys, this is Shonda, and today's video I'm going to be showing you guys a new wig that I got. And I got this wig from ElevateStyles.com. The name of the wig is actually by Free Trust Equal, and it's a lace front baby hairline, invisible natural hairline, and her name is Ari. Now the color that I have her in is called F237 and y'all know me and color, but we gonna see how she looks. So I'm gonna take her out. She comes in a fairly nice sized bag, so she's not crunched up in the bag. She has pretty much all the same things that any other wig will have the uh, cardboard and whatnot to keep it um, to keep the shape then we have of course the net around it and with this one it has a little foam piece that you put that they have right up in here and as you can see the little baby hairs that are on there so we're gonna play with that <sighs> oh my gosh y'all I'm wearing a blonde wig so I'm gonna put it on and see how we like it. Um, it says that it's curling iron safe up to 400 degrees. So we're gonna try it on first without the, um, you know, just the dry fit. Just me putting it on my, my head. Now this has combs throughout it. It has two right here and then we have a comb in the back and then it's adjustable which is good you guys can see all right put it on and take a look at Now this is my first lace front that actually has hairs, the baby hairs on it. So I'm going to play with it and see how it is that I'm supposed to maneuver these boys. Because y'all know, I don't know how to do it. So I'm guessing that what I'll do is just get me, I'm going to cut the lace. And then, um, I really like this curl in it. Yeah, yeah, like y'all yeah, know, I'm scared of color, but I'm, I'm kind of feeling this color. It's a little bright, but I'm kind of feeling it. Oh, yeah, I, I think I like this. Huh? I think I like this. So I'm going to play with the, um, I'm going to cut all the stuff off, all the um, tags. I'm going to cut the lace. And then put it back on and then we're going to play with the baby hairs on it and see what we come up with. Alright, I'll be right back. So trim the lace and begun working on these little baby hairs. And what I'm doing is I'm going to use some spritz. On them. And I'm going to brush them down. And then I'm going to tie it down. Just so I can get them adjusted to actually laying flat. Hold on, Kara.
really like this hair. Um, I don't. I have to try to figure out what kind of blend of hair this is because it does not feel like any kind of synthetic hair that I've used before. The color, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get adjusted to, but you know, it's a light honey blonde. But a catch-all or something to fix that would be to just, you know, get the one, get one in the right color. So again, I got this from, excuse me, ElevateStyles.com. I know, I, I gotta try to make it look as perfect as I could. <laughs> and majority of the color is actually on the top of the wig. I like the curl pattern. I like everything. I like everything about this. Like I said, the color I would have to try to adjust to. I don't know if I could, but you know, that could, that's a cure all. That's an easy way. And I'll have to shape it a little bit. Just go in and kind of cut it, you know, to frame my face a little better. But all in all, I really like this wig. The way that the color blends actually from light to dark. The bottom is look like it could actually be like around a 1B then it gradually goes up into the lighter color so for you ladies that like a lot of color or if you're feeling this color this is called F237 I'm gonna put a link in the side in the uh, information box below so that you guys can be introduced to Miss Ari and again this is from Free Trust Equal and this is I believe 3788 I believe it was $37.88 for this um, wig. And the fibers, again, can be curled up to 400 degrees. So it's curling iron save up to 400. So that means if you want to add a little bit more curl to it, that you can just make sure that you test your settings before you set your head afire. So, guys, if you have any questions, let me know. I'm going to take some pictures and actually post them at my blog and the link to that will be in the information box below and um, again if you have any questions let me know and I'm gonna holler at y'all later